Another day here with Wyola School closed. Parents responded to the superintendent being arrested, but their biggest concern is just to get everything reopened and the kids back in class. Parents outside Wyola School Monday evening had not heard anything about the status of school on Tuesday. But then right around 7, a Wyola School Facebook post states there is school tomorrow, Tuesday, October 17th. The news comes after Wyola Superintendent of Schools Kenneth Deputy Sr. was arrested by the Bureau of Indian Affairs this past weekend on 88 counts of endangering the welfare of children. Parents have expressed concerns about the evolving conflict with Deputy, the Wyola School Board, and the community. Not even the board wants to talk to us, you know, nothing to work out with Kenneth, nothing. A court document states the BIA contacted Deputy last Wednesday about why Wyola School was closed, and it states the defendant violated his duty of care to each of the 88 children currently enrolled at Wyola School. We never heard anything. We were never been notified why the school's been canceled. Prosecutor David Sibley tells Q2 the deputy is not allowed to interfere with the school or contact anyone on the school board pending trial and he is prohibited from participating in school activities until these matters are resolved. If convicted, deputy faces a possible sentence of one day for each student or 88 days in prison. Parents say they consulted with the Bighorn County Superintendent, Bighorn County Commissioners and various law enforcement agencies before the arrest. Superintendent of Public Instruction Elsie Arnson tells MTN her office is closely following the situation, but right now its role is limited on what action it can take. If the principal is not here, no superintendent, the uh, board chair is supposed to take charge of the school and have it running. In Wyola, David J. MTN News.